Well, what's he doing? doesn't like him. Sandy, put Flipper in his pen. Okay, Dad. <sighs> well, I knew the minute I saw that fish that he was dangerous. He's not a fish. Fish or whatever. I happen to know something about animals. Your Uncle Julian and I made three African safaris, and he told me that any wild animal is dangerous. Come on, Flipper. Here, boy. Porter, you as a ranger certainly ought to know that. Oh, they may be tamed for a while, but they can turn on you like that. But the newspapers are full of stories of so-called tame animals turning on their trainers. Look, Martha, now that might be very true of a black panther in the jungle, but it certainly isn't true of a dolphin. <gasps> Flipper turn on us? Why, that's just crazy. Oh, I think I'm a better judge of that than you are, young man. I've seen it happen, not once, but several times. And if your father doesn't have the good sense to protect you, well, I will. Porter, I demand you take that, that beast out into the open sea. What? All right, Martha, there's something you should know. Flipper lives here with us. <gasps> now, I'll tell you what I'll do. You're upset. I'll keep Flipper in his pen, and he won't bother you or, uh... Fifi. Fifi, until you leave. And what about after I leave? What about the boys? The boys happen to be my responsibility. Well, Porter, I think I'll just have to stay here until everything is straightened out. So she's a favorite relative, huh? What are the others like, Dad? friends are laughing at me on account of these clothes. Well, you do look kind of funny. Have you looked at yourself? <laughs> Hello, boys. How's it going? Oh, oh, Dad, are you kidding? Look at us. Uh-huh. Aunt Martha, huh? Who else? Dad, do you believe this? Dad, she says I look chic. Whatever that means. <laughs> well, Bud, I think I've got to go along with her on that. Oh, come on, Dad. Will you stop kidding me? Guy's got to have some self-respect. Not one friend of mine wears these kind of clothes. Not one friend of yours has Aunt Martha. Yeah. And look at poor Flipper. He's going nutty in his pen. He's going stir-crazy. Well, I know, boys, but it won't be for much longer. She's leaving? Well, no, not exactly. Why don't you just tell her to go home? Yeah. Well, I could do that, Sandy, but it wouldn't be right. Now, look, I know things have been pretty fouled up around here, but uh, maybe we'll just start setting them right, huh? You mean you've got an idea? Well, let's just say that Aunt Martha doesn't know everything. We all know that, Dad, but does she?